so it's already late afternoon well not late afternoon early afternoon it is two in the afternoon i'm already dressed for um except for my shoes for work which i go in at four but i'm gonna leave like at 2 45 um and i noticed that i haven't drank coffee in like I don't know how long and I need my coffee so I'm looking for the coffee right now in the covers um, it's not been the greatest morning um, me and George got into a little argument we've been bickering for some time now um, but I think it's just pre-wedding nerves um, that he's getting on my nerves and I'm getting on his. Um, what's it called? But I know it, it's all going to be worth it. Um, I don't know. Um, we're just fighting over the dumbest. Well, bickering, not fighting. We're bickering over the dumbest things ever. All the time and... I hate it because I don't like being mad at him or I don't like that he's mad at me all the time and it's just annoying. Oh, there it is. Found my coffee. Well, my dad's kind of hiding this one. I don't like this community coffee he got too because he wanted to try this one. But I hate it. I don't like it at all. But I'm going to use it to stand. No, no, I'll use this. See, it doesn't even work to stand coffee up. My hair is a mess, but I'm just going to throw it up because tomorrow is my bridal shower, so I don't want to damage it today and tomorrow. Um, so I'm just going to have it like up in a ponytail or something. And I'm wearing this long sleeve shirt. My boobs always look ridiculous in shirts. But I don't really care anymore because... It's my body. I have to learn to accept it. I have gotten thinner, though. Um, they said I got my nails done yesterday. I don't know if it's focusing at all. I got my nails done. And I'm being very careful how I open things how I wash my hands. I did get the shellac so it should last longer than a normal nail polish. Um, I'm, it should but I'm not, I don't know if it is. It's still pretty shiny. I love it. I love the color that I chose as well. It's very natural. I think they would work better if I had longer nails. They did trim them though because this one was um, shorter than all of them so to make them all even so now i have little tiny oh look i'm finally wearing my engagement ring again but i'm about to take it off i miss wearing it i think i should just put like a normal ring on there because i miss wearing my thing so much oh this coffee smells so good okay now i'm gonna put it in this coffee cup that george got me for christmas I love getting coffee cups. <sighs> I love getting mugs. I put about one tablespoon of coffee. Maybe a little bit more. Like just a tiny bit more. And then, oops, I'm using the sugar. That's actually better lighting. It's not the most flattering angle on me but I'm trying to shoot the coffee anyway so let's shoot the coffee and I do about the same amount of sugar so the same amount of coffee same amount of sugar that's just a perfect blend for me and then I go put some hot water
put some hot water in it already. Now, when this coffee is blended like this, I don't like the smell of it. I like the smell of it in the container, but I don't like it when it has hot water and everything mixed in already. Oops. So what I do... I already opened the Hazelnut Delights um, ones. I also have the Caramel Macchiato. But yeah. Um, and I just put one of these in here and it makes it smell amazing and it makes it taste even better. So I just pour that in there. Throw this away as well. I hate messy kitchens. And then I just mix it. And this is what it looks like. Oh, I wish you were able to smell this. I'm such I'm such a coffee lover, but ever since I started working, I just don't have time anymore to even make myself a cup of coffee. Is that crazy? Yeah, I've been stressed out a lot. Envy the wedding as well, and oh, so I drink my coffee, all of it. Um, and now I'm watching my soap opera that I haven't watched ever since I started working so hear the intense music <laughs> it's a Spanish soap opera um, but it's very like not too you know like intense like fornication and adultery it's very young and free and wild and I like it you know it's um, it's very mind liberating. It relaxes me for real, like, and it gives me some sort of empowerment onto how I should be acting as a young adult and not as a. I know my hair is like retarded, crazy, but whatever. Instead of like being so not stuck up, because I don't think I'm stuck up, but no one should think they're stuck up. Should be so stuck up, um, or too like adult yet because I'm still 21 but I act like I'm 30 so I mean responsibilities change that and as many responsibilities let me pause this as many responsibilities that you have that's how old you act so yeah it just keeps me a little you know younger lowers me and I like that but yeah um, I think I'm just gonna edit some of the vlog before I leave for work. Well, actually, no, because I already have to go do my eyeliner and at least put my hair up. I'm not gonna do any face makeup or anything because, like I said, tomorrow's my bridal shower. I am so excited. Um, I can't wait to put on what I'm gonna put on tomorrow, and I still haven't tried it on. That's bad because, you know, it gives me a chance to buy something else if I don't like it. I should try it on before work. I probably should do that. But yeah. It is 2.38.39. And I should be heading out. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So I'm on my way to work. Again. <laughs> Yeah, yesterday was my day off, Wednesday, today is Thursday, and yeah, I have, I don't know if the audio is going to be any weird or something, or it's going to be too loud for you to hear me, but I have my windows sort of down, not too much, put them up a little bit. I have my sunroof um, open as well my back windows are open too um yeah it's a beautiful sunny day after so many days of cloudiness and drowsiness in the sky and it's just a beautiful beautiful day today hopefully i can show it later but yeah it's um i like today Well, except for earlier, like I said, me 
me and George were bickering. I haven't even spoken to him. <sighs> Which I feel like I'm not myself when we're mad at each other. It's just not the same. I don't like, you know, bickering so much. I hope it stops. It just makes me really, really sad and emotional because I feel like we're not connected and we're not in sync with each other. Um, but yeah, I'm excited to go to work. I don't know why. I just want to go. Um, what else? What else? What else? Yeah, I went to the back um, to see my doggies because they can't come out right now because my dad has wet cement. I hate when people get too close behind me. Um, there's wet cement in the front yard, so they have to stay in the back, locked up. Not locked up, like, if that sounds weird. But they have to stay in the back where it's gated and it's safe for them. They have fun back there. They like to be in the front more because, obviously, they're doggies that pass by there and they have fun barking at them. But, yeah. But, Kaido got me dirty. I don't know if you can see that. Kaido got me dirty right there. I'm all muddy. Even my shirt got muddy. I try to get it off. Not when it's wet, but I'm going to try to get most of it off before I get to work. With something wet or something. I'm going to whip a napkin. I always keep na napkins in my car. That's such a necessity, I feel like. If I go or if we go to Chipotle or something. Or I'm just going to keep them. Um, the reason I had them down mostly, my, my windows. I'll get back to the other story later. Um, or after this one. The reason I had my windows down was because it's like the leather, this truck has leather seats in it. And when it hasn't been aired out as much, it's been super cold so I can't open my windows, you know? Like the smell of the leather is so obnoxious and so nasty, I don't like it. Like it just, it makes me want to throw up, just like right now. Um, but I have to deal with it because how, how else am I going to go to work? So yeah, that's the only downside. That's why I don't like having leather seats. I know they're a hassle to have and also it's a, it's a good thing because if you have doggies, you know, the, your cloth seats don't get, you know, order. You could just wipe it off. But yeah, I feel like this truck needs a very good cleaning especially the seats so yeah I just don't like it and the carpet um it's been muddy outside too so anyone that gets in my car or in the truck <sighs> they leave mud everywhere <laughs> I filled up this water thing mm -hmm. my hair got stuck in the window um, but yeah, I'm just going to put up my hair in a ponytail um, when I get to work. Or maybe right now. I think I have time in this light. At this light. Yeah, I'm at a stoplight. Or not. I think it's over. Yep. I think so. Oh no, it's not over. I can still do it. I get my goods. <laughs> I make weird... I've noticed with these vlogs that I make weird noises when, like, in just different occasions. Ooh, a Tiffany blue truck. That's so cool. I don't know. Um, I'm just obsessed with that color right now. Okay, the light turned green. I'm almost done. I'm almost done. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. All right. I'll fix it right now. Um. Uh. That looks sort of better. These earrings that my friend gave me. I think most of my friends are not going to be able to come to my bridal shower. Most of them work until late. And it is a Friday. I wish we could have done it on a Saturday. But I work this Saturday. And we don't want to make it too close to the wedding. The, the wedding, the bridal shower. Or it's my mom and my family organizing it most of it. But... Yeah, I am going to be decorating though. 
um, hopefully I can vlog most of it because I do want to remember everything and I want to look back at it and I got scared. <laughs> I did a double take because I got scared I'm like why am I able to see behind me it's the rear view mirror I am so off today I don't know what's wrong with me but yeah um, <sighs> I'm excited for tomorrow I need to go buy balloons but yeah oh my god one month from today I get married or we get married And I think we're leaving for San Antonio the day after our wedding. Yeah. Should I say that yet? I don't know. Um, yeah, we're leaving for San Antonio. That's our honeymoon. Our pre-honeymoon honeymoon. We just want to do something, you know, before the actual honeymoon. We want to go on honeymoon during the summer. So, but we didn't want to wait, you know, too long or that long. So we're just going to go right away. Um, just something small. Um, go to the attractions there. We've been there before, but not together and not by ourselves, obviously. Um, I'm going to go to Six Flags and SeaWorld, like the main attractions in San Antonio. We're probably going to go to the River Walk and um, a river that's nearby there. Oh river that's so pretty and I almost drowned in oh my god I was so little when I went um, it's a funny story though now every time I get in water it seems like I almost drown I don't know why and I never take the time to take swimming lessons which I really should because I'm I know for sure my kids are gonna have swimming lessons and all those kinds of lessons, you know, that kids need. Not need, but, like, I think they're necessities in their lives. Because you're not always going to be with them. And what if you can't rescue them from drowning? They have to rescue themselves. They have to get themselves out of the water. So, yeah, dance class or ballet or soccer. Like, anything. I'll be one of those moms that is going to have, not a mommy van, but this kind of truck's. And I'm going to be hauling all my kids to piano lessons, violin lessons, whatever they want. You know, I'm going to let their creativity flow. Well, we're going to let, I don't know. I haven't talked to George about that. <laughs> but yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Um, <sighs> oh, I should have put lotion on my hands. They're being very dry lately because I work so much. And I wash my hands so, so much. Because believe it or not, you guys, Forever 21 clothing, not to, like, be, like, nasty or anything, but, you know, like, it's kind of dirty. Like, make sure before you wear their clothing, well, at least from my store, from our store, Make sure you um, you wash them because they get thrown around on the floor. I mean, the floors are clean. Don't get me wrong, but before you you probably before you even probably wear, so many people have worn them trying them on, and that's nasty. Well, to me at least. Um, that's nasty. I don't know. I don't know what other people think of that, but to me, that's disgusting. Um, but yeah, I probably should stop talking because I work there. And yeah. <laughs> All right.